Hey what's up everybody welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel. This week's video is a little different than my normal videos. In this video we're going to be testing out Bloxburg tips and tricks from TikTok. If you guys haven't already, follow my TikTok, it'll be linked in the description down below. Here are the timestamps for all the TikToks that we go through in this video. Anyways, on to TikTok number one. There's something about the way that you understand. Need a rush and we don't need to make no plans. So that was TikTok number one. It showed us four different build hacks that we can do. The first one is a tub with a shelving unit. The second one is a stove with a towel. The third one is custom pillows on a bed. And the fourth one is a custom window. So the TikTok doesn't really show us how to do them, so I'm just gonna kind of do them how I would think it would work. All right, so our first one is the tub. And we're gonna start off with placing our tub. I'm not gonna use the exact same one because I like this one better, honestly, and it's cheaper. Um, and then we're gonna go to structural, and then we're gonna place the wooden plank, the horizontal one in specific. And then you just custom place, I believe, perfect. And then you can decorate it as they did it in the TikTok. They just added like some soap, which we can do easily. Soap. And then they added like flowers and they also added books. So yeah, that's kind of what it looks like. I'm gonna color and then that is the first one done. Okay, so that was the first build hack from TikTok number one. And honestly, it's pretty easy to do and I would totally recommend it because it adds more detail to your home. Our second one is the stove with the towel and it's pretty easy to make as well. So you want to go to structural items and then you want to go to the wooden plank section and then you want to go to vertical plank instead of horizontal plank and then I believe you just place it. Uh, use your custom placement, go to medium grid and then place it like right in the middle. Oh, never mind. You don't use the vertical one, you use the horizontal like we did previously. And then you can color them like she did in the video. So yeah, that was the second build hack and honestly this one was very easy to recreate and I would recommend it. It's not that hard to do. Does it add a lot of detail? Probably not, but it adds just a little bit more if you want that extra detail. Okay, then we have the third build hack from this video. It is the custom placement pillows with the bed. I don't, not really sure how she did it in the TikTok because there's different ways of going about it. So I'm kind of going to skip that one because we have one that's similar later in the video. And we're going to move on to the custom window that she did. So we're gonna place the wall for the custom window and then we're gonna place a window I don't know when, which one she used. I think she just used uh, This clear window because it's the same size. I'm assuming she used that one and then she added some Curtains now we're gonna add structural items and then we're gonna go to the standard square beam uh, I'm gonna use the thin one. That's what she used and we're just gonna do the exact same design All you have to do is just kind of custom place it on the window. So she did like one right there uh, we're gonna go to medium grid so we can place the one right here all right there we go now we just have to color the window all right so i colored the window and honestly i love this build hack i use it in my own videos so if you guys ever want like custom made windows this is a way to go about it because it just works perfectly and you can copy and duplicate them so you don't have to do it each time to every single window and i totally recommend doing this one because i actually use it in my normal videos Moving on to TikTok number two. This one's a little different because it actually shows you how to do the build individually, like step by step. Okay, first what you wanna do is place your fridge. Then you wanna go to the structural items and add a vertical plank. So go to build, go to structural, go to wooden plank. I'm gonna place it like they do in the TikTok. Okay, that was pretty easy. Now we color it black. So we're just gonna color all three of the wood pieces black. Then you wanna go to the decorations and buy a taped photograph and resize it. Now we're gonna put it right in the middle like it had. Go to the scale tool and then let's scale it. Perfect. Now step number five, go to structural and add small square beams around the planks. So I'm gonna do that right now. Okay, I kind of messed up on this one, but that's not the point. <laughs> now it says color them the same as the fridge, so I'm going to do that right now. Okay, so here's what the smart fridge looked like. Now we just have to add the decal that they have in the description of this TikTok. And I'll put the code on the screen right now if you want to recreate this. Okay, adding the decal that they use. 
and now we're gonna add it to the decal and there we go so here's how the smart fridge turned out and honestly it turned out way better than i expected it looks very realistic and honestly it just looks amazing you could totally add this to your modern home and make it more like futuristic looking which is very cool this leads us to our last TikTok, and it's actually made by the same person and we're going to lay it out the same way where we pause throughout the video and we do what they are doing because it's a step-by-step -step tutorial. This one is how to make a toddler bed which is kind of fun and it looks very cool. So step one, get a cube and resize it to the size of a kid bed. So they said add a basic cube. I'm gonna do it like that okay i think that works does it have to exactly be the toddler size i don't even know okay step two says get a few beveled cubes and resize them for the pillows so we're making basically making pillows right now all right putting the cubes like this okay so i made my pillows they don't look exactly like they do in the tiktok but that's not the point <laughs> okay step number three add another bevel cube for the blanket so we're actually making a blanket which is very cool anyways go to basic shapes go to the beveled cube and we're gonna put it at the edge of the bed like they did in the TikTok. I think it was like about right there. Step four says add a transparent cube and resize it like this in the medium grid. So we're gonna do exactly what it says. All right, so we're gonna be making it as small as we possibly can. Um, I don't know. Okay, they said medium grid, so I think it would be like right here. Step number five says add a cube and then make it the same size as the bed frame. And Okay, I think that's good, but I don't know because I really don't know what I did for the bottom one because I had to scale it weirdly, so I hope it's correct. Okay, step six, we're actually going to add the bed this time and not just kind of like test it out. Okay, there we go. We did that. Step number seven says get small square beams for the ladder, so we're going to go ahead and do that. Okay, this is looking off. Something's off here. Um, We're not going to talk about it. I don't want to talk about it. My toddler bed is looking fine, guys. Okay, so that's what it looks like after I added the ladder. I don't think that looks correct, but it's fine. You know, it's it adds character. It, yeah. Step number 10 says get an ordinary rope and place it from left to right and from the cube to the roof so we're gonna go ahead and do that go back to structural and we're going to get the uh ordinary rope like they'd used and they placed it like a few times so we're gonna go ahead and do that as well step number 11 says get a small simple carpet and resize it to your like okay so this is my toddler bed done let's compare it to the other one i don't want to talk about it, guys i really did try on this one and it did not turn out as theirs did thank you guys so much for watching this video make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my youtube channel down below all credits go to the original creators of these tiktok videos their links will be down in the description down below so make sure you guys check them out anyways guys i'll see you guys next time bye <laughs>